And that's like the story of the brigand who was robbing a caravan. And I think it was Sayyidina Ibrahim and Adhim, if I'm not mistaken, one of the Salihin, uh, that someone took some, and there's some juice that in someone's saddle, and they mentioned it to the head brigand. That uh, he asked him, he says, do you want some juice? He says, I'm fasting. And so this righteous man looks at him like, you're robbing a caravan. Like, you're fasting? And he said that I wanted to leave a door between me and Allah Ta'ala open. I wanted to leave at least one door between Allah and I open. He's robbing a caravan, but he's fasting. And the meaning here is really deep though, because there's a lot of people that are just caught up in certain things. They just find difficulty in leaving certain things. And sometimes we as a community will not encourage them to do the good that they do, they can still do. Right? And so, years later, this pious man is in front of the Kaaba and Musharrafah. And then he looks over and he sees the brigand making tawaf. He says, is that you? And he said that, I left the door open between Allah and he accepted me. And he let me in. And this is why I never make anyone despair. And if someone's doing 99 one things wrong, just encourage them to do one thing right. Just encourage them to do the smallest little thing, the tiniest little thing. And you never know, especially in our time, given how difficult things are, is that that could be the door for them to turn to Allah Taala.